Well, that makes this easy. She just came back from a scientific exploration on the snow plains, but she seems really out of it. Almost like she's worried about something. And she won't tell us what happened. We're really worried and want to help, but we don't know where to start. The last time I saw her, she was preparing to meet someone on the snow plains. She even asked for a stove set from me. But no matter how Japard and I asked and probed, Link simply refused to tell us who she was going to meet. <sighs> Such a failure of a sister. So that's why Japard and I came up with this idea. We'd like you to help us find out what's going on. One more thing. Don't let her discover you. Otherwise, she'll probably get upset with us. I know she's used to going into the snow plains alone for research, and we've always believed she can protect herself. But, but this is different. We're worried about her running into strangers. She might get herself into trouble. Oh, right. If you're gonna go find Linksy, you gotta know what she looks like. Linksy Dunksy. Don't worry, she stands out. Oh, I can She's live. blonde like us and um quite short. She's always wearing a white fur hat. If I'm right, she should be waiting for someone at the city exit, closest to the snow plains. We're putting our dearest baby sister in your hands this time. Let us know immediately if anything happens. <sighs> Thank you. Zum Ausgang des Verwaltungsbezirks in der Nähe der Eurzern und finde links. Und dann können wir hinspringen. Und ich gehe. Ich bin noch eh im Verwaltungsbezirk. Sieht süß aus mit den Bommeln. I never knew how long it took to get from the administrative district to the snow plains. So much snow. Even in the northern mountains, it wasn't like this. to get heavier later in the day. Have you got enough warm clothes? Yep. I brought everything you told me to, all thanks to your camping guide. Speaking of which, according to the guide, the first thing we need to do is find a good place to set up camp, right? Flat, dry, sheltered, facing the sun, high elevation. Oh. You remembered all that? I expected no less from you. But 
It's gonna be hard finding a place that fits those criteria. Well, we'll just keep moving and see. The place has to be convenient enough for us to observe the Aurora, too. <laughs> Thanks, Linksy. I'll leave it to you, then. I'm gonna follow right behind you. Flat, dry, sheltered, facing the sun, high elevation. And we need to be able to observe the Aurora. And this is going to be difficult. Oh. Huh. Oh, that's not what we Weihnachtslieder? September. Noch nichts mit Weihnachtsliedern und die zu summen. Ja, aber es ist doch so weihnachtlich verschneit hier. Also, okay. The slope has a good view. It'll be easy to watch the Aurora. Ja, und eben wollen wir es. Und hochgelegen. Uh, nope. Oh, the wind blows strongly through here. And there are signs of direwolf activity. It'd be too dangerous to make camp. I see. Then let's keep moving. Bom, gibt's einen mit dem Eispickel drauf oder was ist das? Hat's überhaupt nicht drauf die Fehler. Sheltered, facing the sun, high elevation. Yes, son. And we need to be able to observe the aurora. And this is going to be difficult. Hmm. In this area, sheltered and facing the sun, plus it's flat ground. But, uh, but there are cliffs all around. Oh, we'll be in trouble if there's a landslide or a rockfall. Also, there isn't much of a view. Oh, I remember a good place that's not too far from here. Follow me. Follow huh? me. Okay. What's in this here? Oh, Schneehaufen. on both sides, but I cleared all the monsters here a while ago, so it should be safe and sound. Also, the mountain wind during this season usually comes from the north, which is another reason why we couldn't camp on that previous slope. <sighs> These two hills can block the snow plains gales for us. <sighs> mm -hmm. I never even noticed! Huh. Camping is a complicated science. Really, but the Kim environment outside of Bellabog is very tough. If the weather here was as good as inside the city, well, then we could have camped anywhere. That's true. I hope that becomes a reality one day. Hmm. Only problem is, the view here isn't great. Are you sure we'll be able to watch the Aurora? <laughs> Don't worry about that for now. Let's get the tent ready, then go find our dinner. 
Sure. I can help out with the tent. I memorized that section in the camping guide. Okay. Then I'll go set up the stove. Oh, if you have any questions, just ask me. Oh? Uh -huh. uh. Oh, why isn't the heater working? Ugh, darn. Doesn't seem like an easy fix. Shrimp the kitchen. All right. I'll ask Pela. Pela, can still go for the barrier. Weird. That's what the guide says. Hey, Linksy, come and have a look at this. Who's a camping car? I did everything according to the guide, but the tent's still wobbly. Hmm. Um. Let me have a check. Main poles check, rope poles check, ropes check. Feeling it. Ah, it's check. the pegs. The pegs. I forgot to mention, thick snow needs leaded iron pegs. Got it. It's definitely sturdier now. Nice job, Linksy. <laughs> it's your kind. My oversight. Uh, I've got a question, too. Can you take a look at this stove? I think it's broken. Huh? Sure, let me take a look. Hmm. The geomero fuel activation component probably stopped working. Do you have a spare one? Uh, no. Uh, Serval told me this was a brand new stove. Hmm. Bring the wrong stove? Does this mean we have to make a fire with Geomero? I specifically got this stove from Serval. Is this thing that That's okay. Nice too. These components are really common. Maybe we can find a spare one in the ruins around here. You take it easy. I'll see if I can find one. Oh, and I'll keep an eye out for food too. Uh, I'll come with you. Finding food is easy, but finding that component is gonna be hard. We'll do our best. If we can't find one, we'll just do what your guide says and chop wood to make a fire. Oh, actually, I have some spare chunks of chio marrow. Get überhaupt nicht viel an. Wie frisst sich die Beine ab? in the ruin. Let me see. Oh, don't tell me you want to crawl in there. Of course I do. It's not like the stuff we need is going to come crawling out. Wolf, or... Uh, in that case, be careful. <laughs> I didn't find any components, but I got this. I don't know if we can still eat it. Hmm. 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 It hasn't decayed. <laughs> it's edible. Really? Well, it's all thanks to the Eternal Freeze. We can eat raw fish from 700 years ago. 700? Frost und das Wachsscheiben. War nicht schlecht. Guck mal, da ist noch was. Huh? Oh, was in this tree trunk? Oh, you ja? found something? There's food in here. Really? <lacht> I'm gonna pry it open. Die Animation haben sie einfach gespart. Ha, Black Screen. Uh, what exactly are. Oh, 
Mimetische Schneeschnecken. Mimetische Schneeschnecke. Schnitt, schnitt. Mime, schnitt, schnitt. Mime, schnitt, schnitt. Weiß, wo zu laufen da ist, um ihn jetzt untersuchen zu können. Schneemäuse, Schneeschnecken, Schneerecken, Schneerettiche. Und als nächstes Schneebananen. This is a hibernating snow Ach, ein Schneerettichhase. Ja, okay. This is a rabbit? Yep, they look really similar to snow radishes. Their ears look like the leaves and their body looks like the radish bits. When they hibernate, they cover themselves with dirt, just like real radishes. Mm -hmm. I see. In that case, please tell nee, me you can put it back. Yeah, it's better for the Snow Plains ecosystem. Maybe, maybe. Oh, let's open it up then. Uh, no, no, I, I, don't worry about it, Linksy. I'll manage. Linksy, Dunksy. Oh. Uh, are these sausages? Sure looks like it. And they were probably placed here not long ago. Could it be... Bellabug Caveman's food? B Bellabug Caveman? See what on the Essen It's a legendary creature. It looks like something between a man and a monkey, well, roughly the same uh -huh. size as a yeah. man, with dark blue Yiki hair. Or the activities are or the big very or mysterious, the... and no one in Bellabug can find concrete evidence of its existence. Well, I've only chanced upon it a few times myself. Whenever I try to take a photo of it, It had already run away. Yeah. Oh, it might feel like these sausages might constitute a great Bellabogian scientific discovery. Let's bring them back with us. Uh, uh, hold on. There are some letters here. Sam something post something. Mm -hmm. uh, I ah, can't read the rest. It seems like a name. Yes, it can't be the Bellabog caveman then. Do cavemen even know key? how to write? Ah. Don't worry, Linksy. 
I'm sure you'll get concrete proof one day. Let's leave the sausages oh, yeah. here. I think someone might be missing them if we take them. Well, I think we've searched through everything here. Let's head back, Pela. <sighs> okay. I feel bad that we didn't find a spare component. Oh, it's fine. We'll just light a fire with Geomero. Let's go back and have some food. Pela? Hmm? What's up? We don't really need that stove to cook. I know, but since we're looking for food, I figured we might as well try to fix the stove. Uh. Linksy, wait! That thing in the camp is a dangerous fragmentum creature. I see it too, but it doesn't seem aggressive. And it's all chubby and cute. Don't be fooled by its appearance. About 20% of our silver main guard fragmentum losses are a result of chasing this creature. We haven't figured out everything about it yet, but there's one thing we're sure of. They have the power to control people. We need to be careful. Uh, what? Is this but, but this little buddy gave me something good last time, and it didn't hurt me. That must be the first step in their mind control process. You were lucky. We should defeat it just to be safe. Fragmentum creatures are Bellabog's enemies. They shouldn't be trusted. Take a photo of it last time. Now's a good chance. Can I at least take a picture, Pela? That's also my job as a researcher. I understand, but the sound of the shutter and the camera bowl might send it into a frenzy. Uh, it noticed us? It might be looking for an opportunity to attack. Be careful. It disappeared. Did it run away? Yeah, that's the nature of these little things. They disappear in a flash when they get scared. Yeah. Well, that's das my conclusion from my long-term observations. As for those lost guards, maybe they were chasing these little creatures and couldn't find their way back. Uh, sorry. Maybe I was overreacting. Oh, don't be sorry. It pays to be careful. Anyway, crisis resolved. We can now make some food. Huh? Uh, our little buddy seems to have dropped something. Hat geschissen oder was? Ja, gucken wir uns die Schweinekacke an. Awesome! Lexi, look! It's a Geomero activation component! I never thought we'd find one uh -huh. here! Oh, so what about you, Lexi? Did you find anything good? Uh, uh, nothing. <laughs> Just some old stuff. It's, it's great we finally found the component. Let's go fix the stove. Huh? Lexi, is something the matter? Nope. Nope. Uh, that's all your imagination. Oh, uh, why don't you take a break? I'll have a look at this stove.
magic. I couldn't figure out the problem at all. No magic here. Just a trick or two I learned from Sir Bob. My sister. Yep, that's her. Uh, what's the matter? Ah, uh, uh, nothing. Just, uh, sometimes I'm a bit jealous of Sarval, you know? She knows everything. <laughs> Same as you, then. Huh? <laughs> I'm serious. Outdoor explorer, mechanic, they're both experts in their field, right? I think you two are awesome. Anyway, it wouldn't be hard for you to get her to teach you something. You're her sister. She'd be happy to teach you. <laughs> well, you say that, but, um... Uh, you know, never mind, it's getting late. Let's cook something. Yay! That's my favorite part! Wait, no. My favorite part is watching the Aurora. <sighs> Anyways, let's take a look at what ingredients we have. Every ingredient has its own effect. And combining them will create unexpected results. Mm -hmm. Ooh, what kind of effects are they gonna make? Hmm. Let's just give it a try. Okay, was tun wir denn rein? Mimetische Schneeschnecke. Tiefgekühlt. Aufpassen. Nicht, dass man mimetischen Schneeschnecken schnupfen. Mit schniefenden Schnäuzern. Schnabel du gut. Oh, halt alles rein, oder? Bom. Auf geht's. Ah, raw fish from 700 years ago and some cute mimic snow slug. I don't think either is edible. Mm, das wird super lecker. Oh, don't worry. We'll make them into a hot pot. Just add cream, biscuit crumbs, and the canned sardines I brought. You're putting canned sardines into a hot pot? Please don't say that. Oh, well then, this will be the main course for tonight. I'll show you what I can do as a chef. Um, why don't I cook tonight? You can take a break. <laughs> oh, come on, it's fine. Just leave it to me. Ta-da! The super delicious Snow Plains Combo Stew is ready. <laughs> <sighs> it smells so good. I'm gonna dig in. War doch nicht so schlecht. Na dann. I'm so full. <sighs> Guess now we just wait for the light show. No. The Aurora should start soon. Before that, let's just chat. Kayla, why did you suddenly want to come camping? Huh? Well, aren't you always saying how you just want to lie in bed when you get off work? Ah, sorry. I hope this trip didn't surprise you. No, no. I mean, sure, I'm not the most sociable of people, but I love camping with a good friend. I had a great time. It's been a lot of fun. Hmm. Oh, you're always like this. Even on this camping trip. You keep trying to do things. You really don't need to. Just leave it to me. Camping is about relaxing. No need to be so tense. I know. It's just, I was really getting into the camping. I felt like I finally got around to doing the things I always wanted to. <laughs> so all those comics you drew for the Tales series didn't count? Uh... 